Let us pray. Lord, open our hearts to the truth of your word, even now as we speak it together. Lord, even now as we resound it in praise and through this worship and through our lives, as we come to your word, let your Holy Spirit inspire that truth might be a revelation in all of our lives. This in Christ we pray. Amen. Psalm 80. Give ear, O shepherd of Israel, thou that leadest Joseph like a flock, Thou that dwellest between the cherubim, shine forth before Ephraim and Benjamin and Manasseh, stir up thy strength, and come and save us. Turn us again, O God, and cause thy face to shine, and we shall be saved. O Lord God of hosts, how long wilt thou be angry against the prayer of thy people? Thou feedest them with the bread of tears, and givest them tears to drink in great measure. Thou makest us a strife unto our neighbors, and our enemies laugh among themselves. Turn us again, O God of hosts, and cause thy face to shine, and we shall be saved. Thou that brought a vine out of Egypt, thou hast cast out the heathen and planted it. Thou preparest room before it, and didst cause it to take deep root, and it filled the land. The hills were covered with the shadow of it, and the boughs thereof were like goodly cedars. She sent out her boughs into the sea, and her branches into the river. Why hast thou then broken down her hedges, so that all they which pass by the way do pluck her? The boar out of the wood doth waste it, the wild beast of the field doth devour it. Return, we beseech thee, O God of hosts. Look down from heaven and behold, and visit this vine. And the vine which thy right hand hath planted, and the branch that thou made strong for thyself, it is burned with fire, it is cut down. They perish at the rebuke of thy countenance. Let thy hand be upon the man of thy right hand, and upon the son of man whom thou made strong for thyself. So will not we go back from thee. Quicken us, and we will call upon thy name. Turn us again, O Lord God of hosts, and cause thy face to shine, and we shall be saved. 